my channel today we're gonna be reacting to the Mashkurai Bergen Love is like a dream it's the new year happy new year to everybody happy 2023 I hope everything that you want comes true for you I myself have a couple of goals that I want to achieve in 2023 and one of those goals is to you know grow my channel a little bit get more subs you know get more active lose some weight if you like this video please consider liking and subscribing I'm a small channel and I really appreciate it but yeah Today we're going to be reacting to Love is Like a Dream that I haven't heard this song before, so let's get to it. That sweet piano. Oh, this is going to be like a tear-jerking ballad, isn't it? Yeah, it was как в зеркало смотрюсь, отражение потерять свое боюсь. Не хочу, чтоб я лишь костен был, сумраки ночей и судьбе твоей. Я люблю тебя, как любят. Жизни раз Словно солнце в мире Не было до нас От забот и мелких сон Я тебя увел И ключи от счастья Для тебя нашел Я тебя нашел Любовь похожая на сон, сердец хрустальных пересвод. I know the melody already, and I haven't heard it. Люблю я тихим эхом повторю, любовь похожая. Well, I can kind of, I kind of know the melody because that's how ballad works. They tend to have very similar progressions. Я прощаю одиночество и грусть. Ты сказала в них я больше не вернусь. Так бывает только в сладком сне. Но любовь у нас на его сейчас. Не в глазах твоих себя не потерять. Да разлуки нам любовь не разменять. И не мысли мои ценой и своей мечтой заслужил ли это счастье быть с тобой. Всегда с тобой Любовь похожая на сон Сердце с хрустальных перезвон Ох, как красивый голос, мэн Твою волшебную люблю He's switching it up, he's playing with his voice. Mm, so beautiful. Mm. 
What? He just went to like three different voices in like five seconds. I'm loving this part. This is my favorite part so far. He should stop. No, it's not done though. I told you all. Yes. Yes. Very nice. Bravo. Bravissimo. Magnifico! Magnifico! Magnificent! That was awesome. I especially liked it towards the end of the song. And there was a part that he sounded so... It was the part where I mentioned that he had three voices. Because honestly, I did hear like three voices in the span of like five seconds. He started very fragile. And then immediately went to more operatic to more like a male opera singer. And then he immediately went to a female opera singer. His pitches and his voice, I think, you know, his tones, that's what I'm talking about. And it all happened so effortlessly and so organically. It's, it was amazing. There's always little moments like that with, with the match songs. He always plays with his voice in the way uh, uh, a jazz musician would play with his instrument. When you're a musician, you try to add little flares, individual flares to little moments. Even though you're keeping the same melody, you're, you're creating an alternative version of it to amuse yourself and to give the song more diversity and give it more depth. And he does that a lot with his voice. Like I kept hearing it and he kept singing the same part but with a different intonation or, uh, you know, switching it around. And I think that's super cool. And that's, like, that's one of those signs that you know He's like a real musician because musicians, uh, I'm a musician myself, okay? I'm not as, as talented as him, but we musicians do that to entertain ourselves, to keep the song fresh. Because when you're dealing with a, a, an arrangement and you know how predictable it is, you want to make it less predictable. It makes it a little bit more progressive for you. It makes it more fun to play. And it's fun to try to find like little alternate cuts to do that in the arrangement. But anyway, I also want to talk about the lyrics. Uh, the lyrics were very, very, very sweet and very longing, very heartfelt. I was reading the lyrics, that's why I was kind of quiet. In a way, they're fairly standard ballad, romantic ballad lyrics. But with the, with the power of the music, uh, it really gets you. Her performance was great. His look, um, obviously, the, the, he's a handsome guy, okay? And, that, and even though I enjoyed it, I kind of want to ask... If, to the fans of the match if they're watching this if the match has more progressive songs like you can recommend me a song from his that it's either more experimental or more progressive because i tend to like more experimental and progressive songs and he's such a talent that i'm sure he has done that right i'm sorry please recommend it to me in the comment sessions i would be really curious to see that if anybody has a recommendation please post them in the comments below and you know i hope that 2023 brings all of us everything that we want. I'll see you guys later.